Hello, my name is Apostolis Bakaris and uh, I'm going to show you how you can use the uh, filter data stored uh, module to provide low level filtering for your uh, application. I assume that you have already set up an application with assembly reference required. I also assume I have already made it, here it is, that your configuration file looks like this. You have a section configuration for filter provider, this one, and here you have your filter providers. This is the skin filter provider and this one is the user filter provider. I'm going to apply those two filters to a model like this one. So we have a customer which have has many orders and each order has many order lines. Uh, I have also made some dummy code here that what it does it creates uh, dummy users. Uh, a user Sam and a user uh, John as the main demo of DevExpress. What will happen if I run the application for the first time? Uh, it will uh, create some dummy data for the first user I log in. I'm going to log in as user sub, so all data for user sub are going to be uh, filtered by this, prov this, this provider, by the skin, and by the user. Uh, let's run the application. login as sub and I am expecting here to see the dummy data all the dummy data all customers be here all orders and all order lines okay that's okay uh, if I change the skin now our skin uh, provider is going to uh, do its magic and filter all the data so I am not going to be able any data for the coffee skin for example. Let's do it. Okay, no data for the coffee. Okay, and go back to caramel. And data is here again. Okay, that's nice. Uh, let's uh, check that if I log in as another user our skin provider, uh, not skin, our user provider works as well. So I'm going to log in as John. And even if I am at the same skin, you see it's the caramel skin, I see no data. Okay, both providers work. Uh, if you uh, see here, uh, we can see data. That's why, uh, this is why, uh, because uh, I have uh, unfiltered uh, these tables uh, from here. Uh, where is that? Here I can put any system table I want uh, not to be filtered. I have module info, per system permission. I have some, some uh, uh, default uh, tables uh, here uh, from the beginning. Okay. What I want to do now is uh, to share customer between users. So if I want uh, to login as some or as John to share the same customers. How can, uh, how can I do that? I'm going to go to the application model, open the application model, not the user model. This one is the application model. Okay. I can, I'm going to go here to customer and where it say disable data store filters going to add 
which filter I want to disable. This is the, the user user filter provider. This name here is the one I wrote here. Okay. So if I do that, uh, I expect uh, every user to share the same uh, customer. Okay. Let's save the model. Okay. Close the application. And login again. Assam. Some have customers and orders. And now close again. And login as John. I expect John to have customer but not have order. Okay, perfect. Uh, what if I want to do the same with the skin module? So every skin I have to share their customer, I can do the same way with this. Go here again, go to customer, add a new item, skin filter provider, okay. Save it. <coughs> Login as Sam. Uh, caramel skin, which is this one, uh, have customer and orders. I'm going to change the skin now to black. Black has no order lines, no order, but has customers. What I forgot to tell you is that uh, to enable uh, filter data store module, you have to do it from the model. So you go here, for example, you can do it at this item or that time, doesn't matter. You go to this module. to the filter data store node and set its enable attribute to true. That's it for the filter data store module. It's going to be released with the expand framework.